Wow, you're doing very well. We've now finished unit six. So we're going to do some revision now for unit six. And we've got five different sounds to look at. The first sound sounded like yeah, 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 yeah. Can you remember what it was? What's teacher eating? He's each eating yogurt. It starts with Y. So our first sound is letter Y. Let's go. Hi, can you see behind me? There's a letter. Do you know this letter? Yes, it's letter Y. Y. And letter Y makes an interesting sound. Let's try and do it together. Sounds like Y. 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 Good. Okay, now we're going to do an action with this. Something that begins with Y that tastes very yummy is yogurt. Yogurt. Do you like yogurt? I like yogurt. So let's make a hand like we're holding a spoon and we're going into the yogurt and we're putting it in our mouth. And as we do it, we're going to make the Y sound. So let's try it. Yeah. 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 Okay, one more time. Yeah. 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 Good. Hey, can you see behind me there's a letter? This is letter X. X. Now X makes an interesting sound. X is made up of two sounds. One is the K sound. Remember, it's a K, K, K. And the other sound is S. Just like my name, Stephen, it's a S, S sound. So when we put it together, it's K, K, K. Can you do that? K, K. Sounds a little bit like kiss. Well, one of the words that starts with X is X-ray. So our action is going to be taking a photo of our special X-ray camera and making the X sound. So you have to make that sound. Kiss. Kiss. Okay, and we're going to pretend to take the photo. So we're going to go. Kiss. 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 Can you do it with me? Here we go. That's good. Well, behind us, we've got two letters this time. A C and an H. Together they make the sound CH, CH. Can you make that sound? CH, CH. All good. Now, it sounds a little bit like an old train. So we're going to pretend to be in an old train. So we're going to move our hands and arms like this, and we're going to go CH. Let's do it together. Ch, 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 ch. Very good. That CH word is in sounds words like ch, ch, chicken. Ch, ch, chicken. Can you hear that sound? Ch, ch. One more time. Ch, 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 ch. Hey, good. We've got two letters behind us an S and an H. S and an H, and together they make the sound shh. Oh, it's a bit like when someone tells you to be quiet. Can you do that? We're going to put our index finger in front of our lips and we're going to go shh, shh. Let's try one more time. Shh, shh. This is used in words like ship, ship, or Sheep, sheep. One more time. Shh. Very good. Okay, behind us we've got two letters, T and H. And not only two letters, but two sounds. The first sound is mm. Mm. This is what we call a voiced sound, voiced TH sound. Okay, so we've got sounds, the words like them, and that, and this, that mm sound. Usually
your tongue, but just a little bit. Mm. Can you make that sound? Mm. The second sound is it's a bit different and you use a bit more of your tongue. It's called an unvoiced sound of TH and it's like this. Your tongue comes out further for this one. So it's in words like thumb and think and three, three. Can you hear that sound? And action supposed to be two clouds. One cloud is a little bit rude and one is very rude because he puts his tongue right out. So we're going to be clowns here, ready? The first clown is only a little bit of tongue and it makes this sound. And the second clown is. <laughs> Very good. 